Hey friends, welcome. If this is your first time visiting, welcome. If you're returning, welcome back. If you haven't done so, hit subscribe. Love to have you as a subby friend. Hit the like button. I'd appreciate it greatly. All right, so I wanna show you guys something super cool today. Um, this is called Plasti Dip. This comes from the hardware store, $4. Now, they also have a Facebook page. I'll put it up here so you can see that. And this is a super, super cool product. I use this regularly. So before I tell you what we're gonna be using this on, uh, what I use it for, I will take handles of things that are thin. If I want the handle to be wider, then I will dip with this. Or if I have a handle that's uncomfortable, I will dip it. So what we're going to be doing, if you guys recall, I have been doing these Dollar Tree cake spoons or cake servers for my niece's cookie bar. Well, these handles, the handles are horrible. Like I could see somebody cutting themselves with that with the handle. And I don't want that. I want them to be able to pick it up and not worry, okay? Especially there's going to be little kids. So we're going to we're going to fix the handle. Oh. All right. This is how simple it is. Now, in the the end result, you need four hours for it to completely dry before you use it, but just so you know. All right, so we're gonna pop this open. It's a pop top. It kinda looks like black pudding. Now, when you do this, you want to be able to hold it up quite high. So if, if the item doesn't have something long that you could hold, make sure you put a string or a wire or something on it. But what you're gonna do, you're gonna dip it. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Go down a little bit. One and two and three and four and five. It's five seconds between each time you go down further. Go down a little more. One and two and three and four and five. A little more. One and two and three and four and five. One and two and three and four and five. And then up. One and two and three and four and five. Up. One and two and three and four and five. Up. One and two and three and four and five and you can remove. Let the drip go. And here's your handle and you can re-dip it as many times as you need to, but you do need to leave at least 30 minutes between re-dip, okay? So I'm gonna put the, when I do this other one, I'm gonna put the um, camera at sort of a different angle because I want you to be able to see, and I'm gonna go down further. Ready? One and two and three and four and five. One and two and three and four and five. One and two and three and four and five. One and two and three and four and five. One and two and three and four and five. And then five seconds a piece as you're bringing it up. One and two and three and four and five. One and two and three and four and five. One and two and three and four and five. One and two and three and four and five. One and two and three and four and five. And there. So it's supposed to be about one inch every five seconds, okay? So I'm gonna put these, set them here to dry, all right? And then we're gonna come back in 30 minutes and we're gonna do them again, okay? And we're gonna put one more edge on them and give them a nice handle. So the colors that I have seen, 
black, yellow, and blue. That's the only colors I've seen. They may have other colors. I don't have Facebook, so if you look on their Facebook site, they may have other colors, but that's all I've seen. So we're gonna come back, we'll do it again, and this one we'll do a little bit longer. I didn't go deep enough, but we'll make the handle just a little bit thicker. All right, I'll see you in about 30 minutes. All right, so we have been our 30 minutes, and now I'm going to do a second dip. Again, it's five seconds, one inch, down and up. All right, and that is going to give us a nice handle. And so you can do this, you know, as many times as you want to, to make your handle as thick as you want. But just doing this, like it, it gives it this nice rubber coating and no longer is it like a razor blade that's gonna cut. So this is really cool. All right, so I'm gonna let these sit. Now you wanna let them sit four hours before you use them, but in about 30 minutes, they'll be pretty dry and I'll show them to you. Now $4 for this container, and you can see I did two, and look how much is, like this container goes a long ways. So you can give your stuff a nice handle and it's not super expensive. Love this stuff. All right, so I'm gonna, give you about, you know, 30, 45 minutes or so, and we'll come back and I'll show you as they're much more dry. All right, friends, so these are dry. So again, this is the Plasti Dip that we used, $4, and this stuff will, there's enough to do tons of stuff. All right, so now I won't be using these for a couple days, so it's fine, and I'm actually gonna go through and do other ones but this will have to sit for four hours before you use it. However, now I could have pushed through there and kept the hole, I really didn't, but this one, the hole came. But, so this is now, look, the handle is completely coated and there is nothing sharp. It is now nice and soft. It's not gonna cut anybody and I no longer have to worry about these cheap handles hurting anybody. So this stuff is great, and I wanted to share it with you because it is fabulous. You can use it for so many things, and um, you can even use this, like if you have a family member who's had a stroke and they're learning to write again and they need a pencil to grip, or you have a child that has a hard time with their grip and you need a wider like pencil or pen and you can't find that, you can actually use this and just dip multiple times until you get the size that you need. You know, like even for um, like silverware, if you need somebody that needs a special grip, this stuff is fabulous. It's great for the ends of tools, like anything that you need. I use this for like my drying wrap, my drying rack. 
Um, I've shown before how it's got like the plastic over the top of it, and that's what this is. So, so many things you can use it for. I thought it would be really helpful to you, so I wanted to share. Listen, I hope you guys have a blessed and beautiful day, and I'll see you later, friends. Bye.